Hey, Bitchin' Bobby here, and on this episode of Bitchin' Bobby's Backyard Eats, we are doing a four-pound bone-in prime rib roast. Let me go ahead and introduce you to the star of today's show. We're going to dry brine it for about six, seven hours, and I'm going to show you how Bobby does a roast. All righty, here she is. Look at this beautiful bone-in rib roast. Kosher salt. Start the dry brining process. That's beauty. Get her in the fridge, and I'll see y'all in a bit. Welcome back. Bitchin' Bobby here. This rib roast is all dry brined. It is looking beautiful. I waited about five and a half hours to pull it. It's been sitting at room temp for about an hour, hour and a half. I'm going to go ahead and make the rub for this and show you how Bitchin' Bobby does a rib roast. All right, what we have here is one pack of fresh dill. All the stems are removed. I'm going to go ahead and dice this up. And you're thinking dill on a rib roast. You're not using garlic, any of that type of stuff. Nope. Wait till you see this concoction here. This is a beaut. All right, nicely chopped up dill. About two tablespoons of regular white sugar. Don't you worry. This will not burn on the roast, promise you. Two teaspoons freshly ground black pepper. One teaspoon fine coarse sea salt. Do this. I want to add a tablespoon of canola at a time until I got the right consistency. You know what I mean? Should just about do it. That's a good consistency for this rub. See that? Almost like a paste, right? We'll go ahead and drop quartered. Yellow onions on each side. All right, here we are. The egg is sitting at about 350. I am dropping this on. I'm going to pull it at the 120 mark and let it rest for the finish. Let's cook this bad boy. The rib roast is just about 120 degrees. I need a couple more degrees to pull this baby off. Then I'm going to show you the unreal, the unmasking of this beautiful rib roast all right it is that time as you can hear my thermometer is going off Ooh. do y'all see that roast that is absolutely beautiful perfectly cooked Look at the au jus oh Ooh you hear that sizzle baby Woo. exactly in a cooler Gonna let it sit about 15 to 20 minutes. All right, let's take a look at what's going on with this Caesar and this grilled bread. Ooh, that is looking good. Ooh, look at that bread. See what we're working with here. I got grilled caesar salad got some of my bobby's famous grilled bread and ranch roasted potatoes the star of the show a beautiful four pound bone in rib roast first thing i'm going to do here is get the bones to fall right off and it is Ooh. let's go ahead and cut a slice shooting for a perfect mid rare Look at that prime rib, y'all. Bobby's done it again. One thing left to do, go ahead and give her a taste. Nice little piece of fat cap here. Mmm. Sweet, savory, absolutely delicious. Please like and subscribe. But for now, it is time to go and eat. Bobby, I'll see y'all later. Y'all have a great night.